who's gonna see you welcome back to my channel if you're new here what's good make sure you that thumbs up subscribe button be part of this gang because that's gangs that's gang lock gangs my hair looks really crazy because i got my baby hairs out or whatever because i'm about to get my hair done and i don't want her to braid my baby hairs back i'm with my girlfriend what's poppin this gang we made it 20 minutes late, but you know, better late than ever. Let me just go straight. I'll lead the way. We're here. So she started, all she did was part my hair, and now she's detangling. And then. We're going straight to it. Oh, and she can't say I was late today. Uh, <laughs> I was here. <laughs> yeah, she was here. I was late. Hey, babies. Me, my new hairstylist named Takara. Um, this was only my second visit. The first time being when she did a rouge touch-up slash um, color correcting. But so far, so good. Um, I don't regret letting her touch my hair. If you guys have curly hair, you guys know the struggle that you have trying to find a hairstylist. But like I said, so far, so good. Um, aside from being my stylist, let me just tell y'all the vibe that you get when you sit in that chair. The things that we'd be talking about is just so crazy and off the walls, but those are honestly the best conversations. Watch, let me, let me tune you into one of our conversations. It's not many by men that's just out here thriving openly, you know? But I will be the first to say, there's a fine ass, you know, by man out there watching this video, successful with his career, open to other opportunities as far as business and everything, vegan or vegetarian like myself. Hey, I'm Takara. <laughs> and she does hair. So. I do hair. I hook your braids up. I braid a heart in the middle of your head because I love you. Okay. Y'all see what I'm talking about? <laughs> But believe it or not, it took a good two hours for these braids, but a two hours well spent. Um, she told me to get cankalong weave for these braids, but I decided to get a braid that was a little more silky and that didn't have the stuff that makes your head really itchy because the itching for braids drive me completely insane. She also told me that a pack per braid would be enough, but I bought way more because I knew I wanted the braid super thick and super long. Um, so I pretty much used two packs per braid. Um, I forgot to buy some beads and string for our hair, but luckily Takara had some on hand and put something together real quick. This video is basically just showing y'all the process. Um, I didn't get much of my own hair, which is why I got some shots of Drew. We took some cute videos and pictures right after we left the shop, so I'll insert that after the video. But as far as the hair goes, it's a few days later and the top of my head looks decent. But as far as the midsection, the braids are really messy. Um, I think it's because she didn't use um, any gels or anything when she braided it. So that's the part that got kind of really messed up. Um, but then again, maybe the longer the braid, the harder it is to maintain because I don't get braids as often. But there was also a chance that she knew that I was probably not going to keep them in um, for very long. But either or, the braids were super nice and super neat. And um, if you're ever in Atlanta and you need your hair slayed, just check out Sakara. Her information will be in the description.